Hi, I'm Jamie Grubel Poser, 2014 Olympic bronze medalist in women's bobsled. Today I want to show you how to back squat. As a bobsledder, we push a 165 kilo sled, almost 365 pounds, from a standstill to top speed in under 50 meters. In order to do that as fast as possible, we need to be strong and really fast. So today, I'm going to show you how to do a back squat so you can become strong and push really fast, just like me. In order to back squat properly, I want to teach you a few important things to keep you safe and help you lifting heavy weights. The first part is the setup. We want to set the stand up high enough so you can easily take the bar on and off of the rack. That way, when you have heavy weight on your back, you have a secure place to take the weight off and put the weight back. The second thing is going to be your stance. You want to balance the weight in the middle of your back. You want to have your feet about shoulder width apart, and you want to pinch your shoulder blades so your back isn't curving forward. The next part of this exercise is the actual squat. In order to start the squat, we're going to keep the weight of our body on our heels. You don't want to come forward onto your toes. The next thing is you're going to initiate the movement backwards with your hips and slowly stretch down to the ground until you're in about a seated position. If you were looking from the side, it would be about 90 degrees. The next thing is when you come back up, you want to squeeze your glutes and push up using your legs and keeping your chest out so your back doesn't curve again. The great thing about the squat is it is an exercise that you can incorporate into many different parts of your training. You can use it as a strength exercise by doing heavier weights for lower repetitions, or you can use it as a conditioning exercise with higher reps and lower weight. It's really a well-rounded exercise that you can incorporate into a lot of different training and it's perfect to become a great bobsledder. Just remember, this is a very complicated exercise and technique is very important in order to lift safely and properly. Don't be afraid to ask a coach or a teammate to watch you lifting to make sure you're doing it right. All right, now it's your turn, so get out there and get lifting.